Hey guys, James Hinchcliffe here, and I'm joined today, as always, by my trusty buddy, John, and I also have EMT Adam Westfall and paramedic Kat Brophy with me, and today they're gonna show us how to attach a three lead and also a little bit of defibrillation, which sounds like a great party. Okay, so like you just said, I'm just gonna basically repeat what you just said. Okay. We're gonna do a three lead mm -hmm. and we're gonna defibrillate. So Adam here, he's gonna do all the work for me because not only is he fantastic, but that's just how this works. It's a great partnership. He does everything. I stand here, I look good, and he just does all the work. So. Sounds sweet. I know, right? All right, so we're gonna start with a three lead. And basically what a three lead is, is it's gonna show us a picture of the electroactivity inside the heart. Okay. Because I can't see it, neither can you. You can't? You don't know that I can. You I'm, don't know I'm that. I'm just gonna take a wild guess. All right. Just, just agree just disagree. Can you work with me? Just work agree with me here, okay? to disagree. All right, so basically what you have is you have two what we call limb leads. Mm -hmm and one leg lead. Okay. And if you look on here, there's letters, mm -hmm. all right? So as long as you can read, RA, right arm, right side, right arm. Yeah, got it. Perfect. So once we have the leads on, I mean, it's not doing us any good if we can't see anything on the monitor, Correct. right? Correct. So what do you think we're gonna do? Turn the, the monitor, monitor on. Man, genius. We're gonna monitor this heart rate. Absolutely. All right, so if you take a look here, mm -hmm. What do you think that looks like? That's I mean, pretty, pretty normal, pretty consistent. Little 79 I mean, beats per minute. I like it. Pretty I'm happy solid. with it. it. Makes yeah. my job easy if it looks like that. All right. Well, you're doing great, pal. No worries. Oh, crap. To, oh man. Oh man. All right. So that's obviously not good, right? That's not great. He, that's not good. Squiggles. I don't like those Bad squiggles. Bad squiggles. Yeah, it's just kind of all over the place. Yeah. No, we're gonna have to do something called defibrillation. Okay. All right. You ever seen a TV show where they take like the paddles and they do all that fancy stuff and they hit the shock button and everyone? Of course, the gel and this. You can hear the yelling. Clear. And cheering. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We're not gonna do that. We have sticky pads. Sorry, I know with I got photos. you worked up for nothing. <laughs> sticky pads with photos. That's supposed to make it better. Um, Fine. it's supposed to make it easier. That's true. So Foolproof. All you do is you follow the picture. Okay. So obviously the picture says put it here. Yep. So we're gonna put it there. Obviously the picture says put it down there, so we're gonna put it there. Basically what this does is there is like metal underneath here okay. that sends an electrical signal from one pad to the other pad. Okay. And then back again. And because the heart's in the middle, it gets the shock. Absolutely. Okay. Yep. So basically what you're trying to do is you're trying to restart the heart. Because I don't like that. It doesn't look good. Yeah, so that's no heart now. Yeah, that's that's not good. Okay, So let's fix that. We're gonna go ahead and fix it. So you ever been told don't touch the red button? Like ever? Once or twice. Guess what we're gonna do. Hit the red button? We're gonna hit the red button. I like so, it. So Adam, all he did was switch it to the red. So right. So we can hit the red button. Perfect. See this right here, it says charge? Yep. Hit that for me. I can do that. You I can, can do definitely that. do that. You I'm got good this. at pushing buttons. So what it's doing is, you can see down here, it's just charging it. Okay. And that's the jewels, it's basically the, electri the electricity. The how much? How much energy we're putting in? Pretty much. I don't cool. know all the fancy stuff behind it. Two hundred joules sounds 200, like a lot. Two hundred, whatever. It's a good number to me. So. Okay. I noticed the red button. I uh, see the red button. <laughs> it's a very okay. red button. All right, James. Uh -huh. Okay. Before you hit the red button, mm -hmm. uh -huh. there's something you have to do first. Though. Do I get a yell clear? Turn around twice. That's like five. Up, oh, jump. Okay, that really has nothing to do with it. But what you are gonna do is you're gonna make sure that nobody is touching your patient. You know, it was worth it. Was it? Yep, because sure? I get to hit the red button. You do get to hit the red button. Okay. So, make sure no one's touching him. So I get to pull a Clooney and yell clear. Uh-huh. All right. The best part. All right, hands off. Nobody touch it. And then I hit that. And then you hit that. All right, ready? Clear! And good heart squiggles again. Look at that. So basically you saved your life. Less body jumping and smoke and not you as know. cool. There's no singeing. Yeah, you know, nothing's on fire. So. A little less Hollywood than I would have liked. They, I, I but feel this like this is real life. Jumped. Jump off the, the table. Exactly. Yep. This is what works in real life. Well, I guess that's what matters, and that's what you guys need to know actually happens. So you're not expecting the Clooney jump and the paddles anymore. Things have changed. But the results are the same. They're here saving lives. Guys, thanks so much for the demonstration and thanks for what you do each and every single day. And that counts for every single paramedic, EMT, EMS, everyone out there. Thanks very much, guys. We really appreciate all the hard work.